Alright, so I'll be teaching you how to uh, set up a standalone server, which is sort of like 10 times faster than uh, the Steam dedicated server that you get with Steam. And if your Steam shuts down or something, your standalone server will still be up and running. <clears throat> so what you need is something called the HLDS update tool. You can download that from uh, steampower.com, but you can go here instead. Alright. You can pause that when you need it. So, let me just download it real quick. I'll save it. Save it to your uh, desktop so you can find it easily. Alright, once it's done, you should have it on your desktop where you save it. Double click it. You should basically know what you're doing. It's not that complicated. But when you reach this, I want you to save it somewhere else, alright? Save it under your C drive and create a new folder. And call it server, alright? And find it, yeah, right there. All right. <clears throat> then just install it. Yeah, whatever. Choose your location. Doesn't really matter. Someone talked to me on Steam. Okay. <clears throat> So you should have this, HLDS update tool, click it, I don't think, yeah, should be doing something, it'll download some stuff, alright, then you, you've downloaded a few more things, okay, so, now that you've downloaded it, you go to run, and type in, CMD, alright? Let me just go back to my room. Okay. You should have your. Um, I forgot what it's called. Uh, yeah, whatever. Your control panel, or whatever. And. Type in. Um, CD. C, uh, here I'll take that up for you. Alright, you type that in. And then you type in, here let me just check. If you want to install a Counter Strike server, I don't want to type it on myself, so you just type, after you've typed this in, you type that. Alright. Here, I'll make that. Um, alright. Type that, alright. You can, uh, Don't forget that dot over there. 
and once you type it it should be downloading a whole bunch of stuff you'll be waiting here for a pretty long time <clears throat> depending on your download speed your internet and like how many files you have up and stuff but yeah you'll be waiting here a pretty long time so just grab a coffee or something wait it out once it's all done downloading you should have something uh, like the dedicated server provided by Steam but it'll run with less lag and you can configure it so it doesn't use as much uh, CPU and you can do a whole bunch of stuff alright if you have any questions you can actually check out my uh, website alright right here I actually have a live support thing so if you actually need 24-7 help we can provide you with it thanks for watching